I'm in Orlando with the Ritz Carlton at the NFL annual meeting, and news has just broke that Jed York is set to become the principal owner of the 49ers. He's buying out his mother, who originally got the team from her brother, Eddie DeBartolo, and then gave it to Jed when he was 27. So now he's gonna be the guy with the most power for once. What's that gonna do to the organization? How are things gonna change? It seems to me that Jed likes to change things. He's the guy who hired Mike Singletary and then fired him after a few years. Then he hired Jim Harbaugh and fired him. Then he hired Jim Tomsula and fired him. Then he hired Jim Kelly and fired him. And I don't know, the last seven years have been a lot different. The last seven years they've had Kyle Shanahan and John Lynch and they just keep giving him extension after extension after extension. I always got the impression that Kyle Shanahan and John Lynch were more of a Denise and John York hire like they stepped in after Jed York had hired and fired fifth coach in 10 years and said, all right, we need to sort of do this as a family and start over and commit to uh, a, a new vision. That's the impression I always got. The, you, the connection from Kyle Shanahan to Mike Shanahan, old and the, the past and the present, kind of always made sense that the parents would step in eventually and say, you know, we want stability at coach because you keep firing people, Jed. So now Jed's back in power. What does that mean? Does that mean that he's actually gonna hold Kyle Shanahan accountable and maybe think about getting another coach if Kyle Shanahan can't win a Super Bowl in the next 20 years? I don't know, maybe. Because Jed does wanna be like Eddie DeBartolo and Eddie would've fired Kyle by now, right? Right, right? You tell me, everyone. Anyway, it's gonna, it's gonna be really interesting to see. New year, new Jed. What's he going to do?